dear students for this year 2020 and 21 SSLC students have to write multiple choice question answers for the annual examination as you know already so Karnataka secondary examination board released model question papers for all subjects as per that I am going to deal with uh, social science subject it's my subject I am Lakshmi Kanta D. Mamdapur I am working as assistant teacher in government high school Kulali Taluk Mudhol so here you have to say all the circles which are given in uh, the OMR seats I am going to explain how you have to answer uh, these model question papers so the first question is Francisco de Almeida implemented uh, which policy was implemented by Francisco de Almeida uh, 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 both are same option A blue water policy option B war and negotiation policy option C divide and rule policy and option D doctrine of lax policy so here the answer is option A blue water policy so next question the second question is Salvai agreement was signed to end the dash so option first A is first Anglo Mysore war B first Anglo Maratha war C first Anglo Sikh war and D first Carnatic war so the answer is first Anglo Maratha war which was ended with the Salva agreement between Marathas and Britishes question number 83 a Fausdari Adalat is what it means they ask as a question option A civil court option B revenue court option C criminal court and option D consumer court here the answer is for Fausdari Adalat means criminal court in the period of Britishers so question number 84 the governor general during the fourth Anglo Mysore war was uh, option A Wellesley option B Dalhousie option C Cornwallis option D Ripon so the answer is Lord Wellesley option A is correct here next 85th question is the social reformer who declared back to Vedas was option A Rajara Mohan Roy option B Swami Vivekananda option C Narayana Guru option D Dayananda Saraswati yes you are right option D is correct here uh, D Dayananda Saraswati is the exactly correct answer for this question okay we will move to the next question 86th question Rani Lakshmi Bai of Jhansi revolted against British due to for what reason she fought against the British we have to write here option A subsidiary alliance option B war and negotiation policy option C divide and rule policy and option D doctrine of lapse policy so here the answer is option D doctrine of lapse uh, policy so next 87th question is Ras Bihari Ghosh or Ras Bihari Bose and Madam Kama are the leaders of revolutionaries option B moderates option C radicals option D extremists so the answer is option A revolutionaries next question number 88 the founder of Indian National Congress is uh, who was the founder of Indian National Congress they can ask like this also so option A is Mahatma Gandhi B A O Hume C 
बाल गंगाधर तिलक एंड ऑप्शन डी गोपाल कृष्ण गोखले सो हियर द आंसर इज ए ओ ह्यूम ऑप्शन बी इज द करेक्ट आंसर हियर नेक्स्ट वन एटी नाइन्थ क्वेश्चन फॉरवर्ड ब्लॉक वॉज फाउंडेड बाय इट वॉज अ पोलिटिकल पार्टी एज वी नो एंड इट वॉज फाउंडेड बाय द क्वेश्चन इज ए जवाहरलाल नेहरू बी सुभाष चंद्र बोस सी डॉक्टर बी आर अम्बेडकर डी बाल गंगाधर तिलक सो हियर द आंसर इज सुभाष चंद्र बोस ऑप्शन बी इज करेक्ट देन क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइंटी लाला लजपत राय वॉज किल्ड ड्यूरिंग ऑप्शन ए जलियन वाला भाग मासक ऑप्शन बी द प्रोटेस्ट अगेनेस्ट साइमन कमीशन ऑप्शन सी नॉन कॉपरेशन मोमेंट ऑप्शन डी द साल्ट सत्याग्रह Here the answer is B. The protest against Simon Commission. On the uh, on that day, he was beaten by the policers and lati charged by the policers, and he was died. So that was the issue, as we know. And then question number ninety one. Mahad Tank and Kalaram Temple movements were organized to protest against the. Uh, A practice of untouchability B visit of prince of wales option C proposal of crips mission D arrest of gandhi in dandi so here the answer is option A practice of untouchability next question number 92 the word added to preamble through 42nd amendment of the constitution are option A republic and democracy option b socialist and secular option c sovereignty and democracy option d regional and secular so here the answer is socialist and secular those are the uh, words two words added to the preamble of our constitution uh, by 42nd amendment next one question number 93 Chennamma revolted against the British from uh, the option is A Mysore B Kittur C Belgavi D Chitradurga the right answer is option B Kittur that was the right answer next one Lokpal and Lokayukta are set up to check set up to check what so option A regional imbalance b corruption c communalism and d practice of untouchability so here the answer is b corruption next one 95th question the constitution of india india's article 51 advocates option a free and compulsory education b uniform panchayat institutions c social justice and welfare of people d establishing international peace and cooperation so here the answer is option d establishing international peace and cooperation that was the correct answer next question number 96 in 1966 ussr means russia had supported to tashkent agreement between which of these following nations option a india and pakistan b sri lanka and pakistan c india china and d bangladesh and sri lanka so here the answer is option a india and pakistan so next question is 97th one the human rights declaration was adopted on it is it we call it as universal declaration of human rights option a december 10 1948 december b december 15 1949 c march 10 1950 and d march 15 1952 the answer is option a or december 10 1948 that is the correct answer next one the cabinet of uno uh, which was called as the cabinet of uno the options are 
A. General Assembly B. Trusteeship Council C. Security Council and the D. Secretariat but the answer is C. Security Council is known as the cabinet of UNO. Next question number 99. The question is the chief architect of the Indian constitution is option A. Dr. B. R. Ambedkar, uh, B. Dr. Babu Rajendra Prasad, C. Jawaharlal Nehru, D. Mahatma Gandhi. The answer is A. Dr. B. R. Ambedkar. Question number 100. The question is the book The Republic was written by option A Aristotle B Plato C Karl Marx and D Augusta Compton so the answer is B Plato 101 question number Karnataka state Raita Sangha was founded by option A Rudrappa B Basavalingappa C MD Nanjunda Swami and D. N. D. Sundaresh. Option C is correct here. M. D. Nanjunda Swami, who was the founder of Karnataka State Raita Sangha. So that is the correct answer. 102. Question number Child Marriage Prohibition Act was passed in the year A. 2006, B. 2007, C. 2008, and D. 2009. The answer is A. 2006. Next question, 103rd question. The highest peak in the Eastern Ghats is Option A. Anaimuri B. Armakonda C. Guru Shikhara D. Nilgaris The answer is Armakonda. Question number 104. Dras near Kargil is prominent for lowest recorded rainfall in India, highest recorded temperature in India, lowest recorded temperature in India and D highest recorded rainfall in India. The option is the correct answer is option C lowest recorded temperature in India. Question number 105. The black soil is derived from option A crystalline rocks B basalt rocks c granite d coal the answer is basalt rocks option b is correct here and question number 106 still like roots are found in equatorial forest tropical deciduous forest mountain forests and mangrove forests uh, the answer is option D. Mangrove forests. Question number 107. The west flowing rivers of peninsular plateau of India are A. Mahanadi and Krishna B. Tunga and Bhadra C. Narmada and Tapi Tapi was called uh, Tapi is called also as Tapati and D. Kaveri and Palar so here the correct answer is option C, Narmada and Tapi. Next 108 question number. Sifting forming and sedentary forming are the two types of option A, commercial forming, B, intensive forming, C, irrigation forming and uh, D, subsistence forming. So the answer is here subsistence forming option D is correct here. Next one 109th question. The gateway of India is uh, the which city is known as the gateway of India. Uh, option A Delhi, B Chennai, C Kolkata and D Mumbai. Mumbai is known as the gateway of India so option D is correct here question number 110 the iron and steel industries under private sector among these is Ispat steel plant B Bokaro steel plant C Belai steel plant and D the 
सेलिम स्टील प्लांट ऑप्शन ए इज करेक्ट हियर इश्पत स्टील प्लांट इज वन व्हिच इज अंडर द कंट्रोल ऑफ प्राइवेट सेक्टर क्वेश्चन नंबर 111 वन ऑफ द मेजर्स फॉर प्रिवेंटिंग कोस्टल इरोशन इज ऑप्शन ए कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ डैम्स अक्रॉस द रिवर्स बी रिस्ट्रिक्ट सैंड माइनिंग इन कोस्टल एरियाज सी अवॉइड द कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ लार्ज डैम्स एंड रिजर्वियर्स ऑप्शन डी कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ हाई राइज बिल्डिंग्स सो हियर द आंसर इज बी रिस्ट्रिक्ट सैंड माइनिंग इन कोस्टल एरियाज क्वेश्चन नंबर 112 द ओल्डेस्ट एंड स्टिल एग्जिस्टिंग न्यूज़पेपर ऑफ इंडिया इज ऑप्शन ए बॉम्बे समाचार ऑप्शन बी मंगलूर समाचार ऑप्शन सी बेंगलुरु समाचार ऑप्शन डी मैसूर समाचार ऑप्शन ए बॉम्बे समाचार इज द राइट आंसर हियर क्वेश्चन नंबर 113 द Ports situated in the Union territories of India among these A. Kolkata, B. Vishakapatanam, C. Ennora, and D. Port Blair. Port Blair was the correct answer. It is situated in Andaman and Nicobar uh, territory. Okay, so the next question 114th. When National income is divided by total population. We get what we get option A gross national income uh, that means uh, B per capita income C standard of living D life expectancy option B is correct here per capita income is the right answer question number 115 Ashray Yojana was implemented to provide what to provide option A employment for unemployed people option B shelter for the shelterless people option C agricultural land for landless people option D schools for illiterates option B is correct here shelter for the shelterless people question number 116 a uniform system of Panchayat Raj institutions what the country was established by 73rd Constitutional Amendment Act in 1993, Option B 63rd Constitutional Amendment Act in 1963, Option C 53rd Constitutional Amendment in 1953, D 43rd Constitutional Amendment Act in 1973. A option is correct here. 73rd Constitutional Amend Act in uh, 1993. That was that is the correct answer. Question number 117. The account holder can withdraw and deposit any number of times in a day in this type of account. We have four types of bank accounts here option a saving bank account option b current account option c recurring deposit account and option d turn deposit account so the correct answer is option b current account then question number 118 the national saving certificate are issued by who will going to issue this certificate Op option a post offices option b state bank of india option c reserve bank of india and option d land development banks so the correct answer is a post offices will issue national saving certificates uh, question number 119 world consumers day is celebrated on option a 15th march every year option b 14th february every year C 14th November every year and D 15th August every year the answer is A 15th March every year question number 120 the last question for this uh, social science uh, paper the consumer protection act came into force in India in the year which year uh, the consumer 
Protection Act was came in force in India. Option A 1962, Option B 1972, Option C 1986, Option D 1996. Here the answer is C 1986. So like this we have to uh, get the answers for model question paper which was published by the Karnataka Secondary Education Examination Board very early early uh, so this is all what I explained for you people you can subscribe my YouTube channel Lakshmi Kanta Digitech for my upcoming videos I am going to explain about the content also there so you you can subscribe my channel and you can watch my videos directly thank you so much thank you for watching